Strong in Africa Foundation was brought to limelight in 2009. We founded Joy in Africa based on the fact that I want to give back to the society. I was really sick when I was young. As a matter of fact, I'm a beneficiary of charity also. I was helped. I was uh, helped by an Irish priest who sent me out of Nigeria to have a surgery where one third of my tongue was amputated and the result of a tumor was removed from this side of my face. And nobody believed that that little girl would ever be anything in life. So this is what is motivating me, you know, giving other kids a chance. funding to be able to put things in place that will help these children to enable them to be who God wants them to be and be integrated into the society. In this part of Nigeria, Delta State where we live, this uh, issue of stigmatization of children with disabilities is still, you know, gaining momentum. So we want parents to bring their children out so that Joy in Africa Foundation can be able to help them. But it's still a challenge. It's still a challenge for us to convince them. When the child is, is born and the child is a special needs child, they feel the child is not needed in the society anymore. The child is an outcast. But here in Joy in Africa Foundation, we welcome every special needs child. My son is here in Joy Foundation School here in Asaba. And since I brought my son here, I find out the boy has changed, totally changed, and there's an improvement in the life of that boy. Since I brought him to this center, I have seen a lot of improvement in him. And apart from that, I noticed that this center has really, despite the short period that I knew them, they have really added a lot of things to his life. Even to us as a family, they brought succor and relief to us. But I noticed that in this center, they, they don't have the necessary equipment to help these children. We need a lot of facilities in the school to run this NGO. So I am appealing, whatever foundation Whatever group, whatever um, international body that wants to help should assist this center by giving them the necessary equipment, the necessary machines that they need to make these children's life comfortable. In Africa, center is a selfless service. I established this organization by selling my car because the passion was so great after going around to appeal for funds and the expectations was not much coming. Though I had some few help, honestly, I need to appreciate those individuals. When we were not able to meet up with a certain of this and I had to sell my car to Yota Picnic at that time to set up this center. And since then we have actually been struggling financially but i'm not saying i'm not grateful honestly i'm grateful to god assisting joy in africa foundation is assisting service to humanity and the reward can only come from god when you bless these children when you assist us to help these children